Visibility graphic overrides of an element category. We can ed edit the visibility and the graphics of any element category. So we can go into a project view and say, hey, we want to see what that looks like differently than what our normal settings are. So I could set, you know, make my levels a little bit lighter or something like that. Or perhaps maybe we go into my first floor plan and we go in here and say, ah, you know, um, uh, sometimes we'll have furniture in there and maybe we'll have like the furniture not show up as strongly. Uh, so maybe it's, you know, half toned or something like that. So let's go into back to our east here. Uh, or let's go into let's go into our north and say let's make some changes to our graphics of our north elevation. First thing we want to do is we want to go uh, up to our uh, we want to go up to uh, our view and go to visibility graphics. Now. This visibility graphics is applied for just this elevation north. We have a couple of categories across the top. So we have model category. This is for all our model of our building. So you notice it's filtered. It's filtered just to be only the architecture model categories. If you are working on things like electrical and mechanical, uh, piping, that kind of stuff, you want to check those. You can scroll down and you can see each category then has uh, has a section. If I hit the plus sign, I can go and say, ah, let's take a look at you know wall sweeps or hidden lines or common edges type things. Um, so uh, let's go and take a look at windows. Windows, we have the glass, we have hidden lines, etc. So let's say I want to do something about the glass here. I can pick on this line. And then I can go to, you know, the projection surface or the pattern or the transparencies. So where it's gray here, that means there's nothing set for that. So when you click on this area, uh, that means you can override it. Okay. So like if I go up to this one and pick on this one, there's nothing I can do in this section. I can only override the lines cut. So we have the line for any projected surface or the pattern or the transparency over here. If it's cut, like a building section, we can determine those lines and patterns. We can also go half tone and we can also click on the detail level. So for example, in the windows, if I go by, by view, I can say it's coarse, medium, or fine of what detail level I want. I can also go into my annotation categories. And in here, these give me all the annotation, anything as a dimension, a tag, notes, all that type of stuff. You'll see in here that you know we have things about our grids, etc. where we can set the half tone. And right now, we, if we wanted to get these levels, for example, these levels here, uh, I can say, you know what? We wanted to make those half tone. I can apply. And you can see now that my grids over here have gone to a half tone, if that's what you wanted to do. All right, so we can change the visibility of any element category in a particular view by going up to our view tab and going to visibility graphics.